A Wisconsin veteran was honored with a Purple Heart in Prairie du Sac this morning. It is America's oldest military award, and the mother who received it today tells us it took years for her to finally receive the honor. Our Catherine Merck shows us what it means to her and her loved ones. It's a long time coming, and, it, and it's uh, nice for her to be validated. It was an emotional day for Rebecca Litcher as she was given a long-awaited piece of recognition for her service. It felt uh, long overdue um, and nice to finally have. Rebecca was deployed to Kuwait during the invasion of Iraq in 2003, where her injuries in service qualified her for the Purple Heart. There was paperwork on a desk for me um, to receive the Purple Heart along with a handful of other soldiers. Um, however, it did not get pushed through at that time. After she served, Rebecca said she later worked with Senator Tammy Baldwin's office to receive the award. Now, 20 years after Rebecca was first deployed, the senator presented her with the award at the ceremony in Prairie du Sac Friday morning. You have made your family very proud, and you have made Wisconsin very proud. Throughout today's ceremony, it was made known that this is not an award that's earned, rather, it's deserved. None of us want to receive this award, but it is an award that happens when we least expect it. Even though the long-awaited Purple Heart was something years in the works for Rebecca, it's a lasting reminder of the sacrifices she made for her country. Very emotional. Reporting in Prairie du Sac, I'm Catherine Merck, News 3 Now. The National Purple Heart Hall of Honor is in Windsor, New York, where Rebecca will be recognized as well.